You seem upset. Are you doing okay? No, I'm not good. I am weeks away from giving birth, and my baby's father is on now great terms with his wife. I wouldn't say they're on great terms. At any given moment, Joey and Miranda could be on the verge of divorce. I think their marriage is just sustaining for the moment. Whatever you want to call it. He hasn't helped me in this pregnancy at all. He hasn't spent a dime on this baby, and I really did think that by now, we would be back together. You went to your prenatals. He drove you to the hospital a few times. I know it's not moving as fast as you'd like. Mel, I had vanishing twin syndrome. I was high risk. My baby was low in growth. I didn't get to have a gender reveal. I didn't get to have a baby shower. I, I had a poor excuse for a pregnancy announcement. I asked my baby's father for a crib and now his mom is getting it for me. And then I asked him for a 3D sonogram and because his sister got in the way, I can't even have that. I have gotten nothing in my pregnancy. Nothing in my pregnancy has gone right. Your baby is healthy though. I think that's all that matters. Yes, but I still want what I want. And I want Joey. I've always wanted Joey. I want my baby to have a father. I want to have a family. And I know Joey loves me. I know he does. So if my pregnancy had to be without everything else, without a baby shower, without everything, well then I want one thing and I'm going to get it. He is going to be in the delivery room. That is happening. No one is going to stop that from happening, Mill. I'm just being honest with you. With my daughter Gabby back in the picture, I don't. Your daughter can kiss my ass. So can Nanny Agatha. This is my life, my baby, my family, my Joey.